Hello, folks. Astronomy 2021. Here we go. We are we're gonna have some fun. We're gonna learn about all sorts of cool things. And I am so excited that you took this class. So excited. Whether you cho chose to take the class or you were just put in the class or I don't know. I'm just glad you're here because I get to teach it. It's my favorite subject to teach. So thank you all for being dumb enough to sign. I mean, being placed in this class. Um, so got a couple basics we got to go through here. Um, so I'm going to smallify this here uh, picture of me. I'm going to present the screen here. All right, so in case uh, you didn't know, um, that uh, we're going to be doing astronomy here, folks, and uh, I'm your teacher. However, this man, if you've never seen him before, is the great and wonderful Neil deGrasse Tyson. A couple things about Neil that you need to know right away. One, check this mustache out. That's a sweet mustache. Try not to stare at it too long. Connor, good mustache? Mm -hmm. That's my son. He's playing Minecraft. And he yeah, agrees. Oh, I'm sorry. He's playing Roblox. Anyways, Neil deGrasse Tyson. Most fantastic mustache ever. Next, Earth. Some of you took a class called Earth Science, and you should know this next fact already. But some of you have, have not, so we need to establish this right away. Earth. It's round. Yes, folks, it is. It is a sphere. That's how they say sphere in German. Actually, that's not true. I just made that up, but it sounds funny, so I'm going to go with it. Um, so it's a sphere. Um, fun fact. Round earthers, or I should say flat earthers. Flat earthers have a common phrase, and the, the phrase is this. The only thing to sphere is sphere itself, right? The only thing to sphere is sphere itself. Flat earthers. <laughs> That's funnier than you guys are allowing it to be right now. You're just being sarcastic. Pluto. Another fun fact that we have to establish right away. This is Pluto. This is a close-up image of Pluto. Um, this is from a satellite that passed it in 2014 called the New Horizons Mission. And when I say 2014, that's like somewhere in that range. So it could have been 2015, could have been 13, but somewhere in that, that mid-teens range. Anyways, Pluto. It's a planet. Nope. <laughs> it's a dwarf planet, folks. All right. And it's going to stay that way. I know that's hard for a lot of people to accept, um, but it is indeed a dwarf planet. Um, I, for one, am happy it's a dwarf planet because it makes more sense that it is a dwarf planet. And if you would like to talk about this sometime, I will gladly talk about it with you. Just not in this first video. Next fun fact that we have to go through. What is astronomy? Astronomy is this, right? We're looking at stars. We're learning about constellations. We're learning about how stars live and die. We're learning about the formation of planets and why there are different types of planets and all sorts of good things. That's astronomy. What astronomy is not is this, right? We are not going to be learning about your horoscope. We will not be learning your lucky numbers. Um, we're not going to know why a Sagittarius is not good with an Aries. Actually, I just made that up. I have no idea if that's true. Um, if it's true, it's not true anyways, because it's astrology. Anyways, um, we are not going to be doing astrology in this class. So if you signed up for this class because you wanted to learn more about your birth sign, bad news. You're going to want to contact your counselor and say, I want out. All right. I usually have one or two students that take this class in, in, you know, in thinking that they're going to learn about their birth sign, their horoscope. That is just not the case. I'm sorry to say. Um, so anyways, folks, this was your introductory video to astronomy. 
at North Farmington High School.